Hi Mala, just making this video to tell you a little bit more about the wear schedule and the care routine for your son Charlie's neoprene brace. So when it comes to wearing, um, because it is neoprene material, we do want to make sure that he doesn't have any allergic reactions to the material. So we're going to put it on for about 15 minutes and check for any redness, bumps, rashes. Um, and if he doesn't have any, then we're going to put it on for about 30 minutes on and 30 minutes off until he builds up tolerance. Um, and as he builds up tolerance to it, we can begin to increase it by 15 minute increments. And then the goal is that he can um, withstand the brace being on uh, for a full functional activity uh, that's low intensity. So activities that we want him to have the brace on are the low intensity functional activities such as handwriting, school-based activities, video games, feeding. Um, and he can take it off for the more high intensity activities such as basketball or running around outside where he actually might need that wrist flexion and the ulnar deviation uh, that the aluminum stays would be preventing if you were wearing the uh, brace at that moment. Um, other than that, he should also be wearing it at night with the volar pan extension in. This will help keep him from flexing at night like he's been doing and help prevent contractures and further tone um, abnormalities. Um, when it comes to care of the neoprene material, we should hand wash it in warm water and do it frequently. Um, this is to prevent stench and buildup of body oils getting all over the neoprene material. Um, and then you just want to air dry that. You don't want to throw it in the dryer or anything. Um, if you have any questions, let me know should be pretty easy to care for.